when I thought about coming over here, I thought, well, today, you know, I got to put on my bridging clothes, so I'm sorry I haven't got my blue cadet hat on this morning. <laughs> but, uh, you know, it's okay to ask, and I'm not afraid to ask, but I'm always awful. I, I just have to come back and say thank you for what you do. You are the big brothers to those two little girls that I told you about. You are their big brothers. Don't ever forget that. And every little girl and boy needs a big brother. So always. You know, every time I come here and I ask you for things, and you always come through for me. You, do you realize when I look at that pile of uh, towels, and I think about those little kids that are gonna have a towel because of you? Think about that. <laughs> So once again, I always love to say this story. Jesus cured 10 lepers. Only one came back to say thank you. I am that leper. Thank you very much from the bottom of this old man's heart. Dear friends in Christ, Mother Teresa once wrote that the hunger for love is much more difficult to remove than the hunger for bread. I think that is a good reminder for us as we bless these gifts for bridging this morning. Your effort in bringing in all these items for those who are in a moment of transition in their lives, those who need a bridge, those efforts have to be grounded in our love for our less fortunate brothers and sisters. So please pause for a moment of silence. Look at the wonderful pile of gifts we have gathered here, all of which you have given out of your generosity, and really project upon them your own love, that those who receive them will somehow know in ways only God can bring such awareness that those who receive them will know that you love them. Let us pray. Dearest Father, we thank you for loving us so much that you gave us your Son to be one of us. Bless these gifts. Let them be a sign of our love for others. And bless especially all those who will use our gifts. May these towels and blankets give those who receive them a heightened or renewed sense of their own human dignity. May they bring them comfort and an awareness that others care for them and wish them well. Father, help us to recognize the many gifts and talents you have given to each of us and teach us to use them for your honor and for the good of all people. We ask this through Christ, our Lord. Amen.